President Rani Vikramasinghe underscored the significance of religious harmony for economic development during a meeting with all religious leaders of the Northern Province at the Jaffna District Secretariat this morning. So far, our discussions have focused on the post-war situation. We are working on resolving those issues. The remaining hurdles, particularly concerning missing persons and providing houses, demand decisive action. By 2025, we will collectively bring closure to this pressing matter. Matters. We cannot afford to remain entangled in the past while other religions move forward. This is the North's moment to seize the potential and embark on a transformative journey. In this, I seek the unwavering support of all religious leaders. Let us shed the divisive garments of religion bias and racial prejudice. The path forward lies in fostering religious unity within Jaffna. The government pledges to tackle the issues of co-wills and mosques in war-affected areas. We will rebuild those damaged and beyond that, stand ready to collaborate with Hindu priests and the of Nalur Temple in erecting a magnificent new temple in Jaffna. But the final decision rests with you, the religious leaders. Governor, I urge you to convene a forum with all faith leaders across the north, fostering dialogue and charting a path towards this shared vision. Jaffna's future lies not only in healing, but also in progress. We envision a vibrant educational hub empowered by a new policy allowing anyone to establish universities, embrace best practices and expertise, be it local or international, to establish this centers of learning. Let Jaffna also become a tech hub, spearheading advancements in artificial intelligence. Your active participation is crucial. This is not my vision alone, but a blueprint for the future. From next year, job creation becomes paramount. Failing to do so will only fuel further unrest.